First of all, we've been debating a lot. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm part of this uh, movement that you mentioned before, Connectivism, and it's the only uh, Italian literary movement, and one of the very few in Europe, I guess, because I, I don't know how many of them. But anyway, um, we've been discussing on the meaning of science fiction. I don't consider myself, to be honest, a science fiction author. I use science fiction traits to focus on certain aspects and to urge a reflection on certain nowadays uh, important matters because I, I think that after all science fiction which in theory should be a literature of anticipation you know preceding things that still have to happen but because things happen so fast reality runs much faster than science fiction so science fiction has become uh, ultimately become a form of uh, uh, observation of certain aspects of reality it's another form of realism I, I, try, I like to call my novels uh, um, a sort of uh, enrich the realism, you know, uh, approach. Because I think that uh, through these uh, special lenses we can focus on uh, what is mostly disquieting. We, we can maybe get ready to this point of singularity where reality might slip out of our hands and of our control. In this sense, I think that this science fiction lenses applied to literature, uh, um, applied to realism, I mean, uh, offer us a great opportunity to deal with what is uh, politically and socially hottest in our time. And, uh, uh, well, if you, if you think of, the great, uh, of some of the greatest uh, dystopian novels, uh, let us just mention 1984 by George Orwell. I think that book, was, was, that was a, when it came out in the sort of science fiction. What it, it, isn't it a perfect, you know, image of what reality has become today? So I think that literature, through these science fiction lenses, whenever I use them, because I don't often, I mean, I don't always use them, can really help us deal with the uh, most uh, uh, dangerous aspects of our reality. Let us just think of how big uh, uh, IT multinational corporations are controlling our lives through social media and other, uh, you know, uh, IT, uh, IT uh, instruments. Uh, let us think of all that we share. I, I do that.